giving you a closer look at this Rain Lax umbrella. Okay, it's got a little sheath here that covers it. Which I won't work that in there right now because I haven't wound it up very well. But this just slides on over top. It's a very tight fitted one, so you do have to wrap it up very nicely in order to get that on. Okay, so as you can see, it's got a curved handle that's nice for you to grip. And here's your power button, and it's got just a cord, like a rope cord handle um, that runs through this actual handlebar. Okay, so we'll unvelcro that and show you how it works. Now this has got a power button to put the umbrella both up and down. You don't have to worry with adjusting anything, so we'll go ahead and pop it open. There we go. Here it is, it's open. As you can see, it's a good size here. Um, this would be good for shading you from the sun on a sunny day like today, or from the rain, of course. Okay, and then um, the little bars in here have plastic coverings, so uh, any sharp metal pieces are covered with the plastic coverings, and the bars in here um, are just nice and intact, looks good. To close it, you just hit that button, and it'll collapse down. And then you slide it closed and you can wrap it up. So again, nice one button handle. Okay, and collapse. Sometimes I feel like on the snap, it doesn't quite have as much force as I expect it to. And it takes kind of a minute to sink into place. Um, but you don't have to do anything to adjust it. It will open on its own. Okay. In order to get that spring pop to open again, you do have to bring it down like that until it clicks, and then it will pop open. So it's nice, you don't have to mess with any pieces here. Everything that you use is just this button. So it makes it easy and convenient, much nicer than some of my older umbrellas that I have. And that is it.